Hi guys, uh, so today we'll clean um, one of uh, my laptops, or in fact my girlfriend's laptop. Uh, I'm a big fan of uh, Dells, especially the XPS type. This is one of my uh, first ones. I own four of them. In fact, my newest one is also Dell XPS. They are perfect quality. They look great. They're made of very good materials, but it doesn't mean that you cannot, uh, that you don't have to uh, clean them from time to time. Now this one is neglected, it's extremely loud uh, because of that. Uh, it has, uh, it's a type of um, computer that has its dedicated graphic card, which makes it usually louder than the ones with integrated one. It's big, it's heavy, also because of this uh, large battery, uh, but it shouldn't be as loud as it is. So what we'll do today, we'll open it and we'll see what happens inside. Okay, let's start with unscrewing a few screws. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten of them. Now, um, I will use my Vera screwdrivers here. Uh, this is the precision screwdriver, which is very good uh, because it, it it's not with... Um, replaceable tip but uh, uh, permanent like this one and like this uh, wheels at the end that speed up the process uh, i also owe two sets of this uh, cheaper types of uh, precision screwdrivers which i find extremely uh, extremely useful uh, because they have much much more types of uh, tips than this uh, vera set uh, this one is higher quality I would say. Okay, so what we'll need, we'll need screwdriver and basically the compressed air. Okay, let's start. So a great thing about uh, quality products, also computers, is the attention to details. One of them will, uh, we see here because the screws are kept with little circlips. So uh, it's very difficult to lose them unless you really try. Uh, this is not always the case with cheaper brands, which you uh, even here try to save some money. So when you open this bottom cover of the laptop, you sometimes end up with one or a few less screws than you started with. Okay, I think we are done. This one's done. One's done. Let's remove the battery as well. So you can see this is this large replacement battery that I recently uh, got for my girlfriend so she can carry the laptop away from the power socket. Okay, so this is removed. There are some small indentations that hold the plate in. As you can see, I'm not sure how well you can see it though. There are some circlips that hold the screws in. Okay, so we remove that. You can see the interior of the uh, laptop with the hard drive, with some RAM, with the uh, fan that cools everything. And it's extremely loud, as I said before. And this is the main area where the dust collects. Uh, we will be able to remove these covers here when I try hard okay and this one as well but this should be fine so uh, let me just zoom in a little bit so you can see now how bad it is it will be even more visible when I uh, spray some compressed air in you should be able to see some dust 
coming out uh, this way or that way. In fact, we will start with the cover itself. You, uh, you can see there is a large spot of uh, dust which blocks the air from coming inside the computer and it makes it even warmer than and louder than it normally is. All right. Okay, so I've got my can of compressed air. I'll shake it a little bit so the pressure inside is higher. You can sometimes get, or oh, most of the time, get this uh, small tube that uh, allows you to precisely uh, spray it in a specific location. But that should be okay. I think I lost it somewhere. Okay, so let's try with this section. I wonder if you'll be able to see dust coming out on the other side. Yeah. Okay, so initially you saw the dust uh, being removed, then the cold air coming out. I can see a lot of uh, particles of dust flying here now. Okay, it's a little bit cleaner. Now let's have a look at the main source of dirt. Okay, this removed a significant amount of it. And let's have a look here as well. Oh yeah. By the way, be careful because when you use it for a prolonged time, it gets really cold. You can see some condensation on the can already. And let's spray all over. Okay. And that will be it for now. I will obviously clean while I have it open. I will uh, take a microfiber wipe and uh, clean the screen and the keyboard. Uh, but that's uh, basically all I can do at this stage and uh, hopefully it will give it a few more months of uh, um, life. Thanks uh, guys and girls and have a great day. Uh, I hope you enjoy the video. Bye bye.